in, in UK? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Him and Muhammad Alasi, they was in Tahir Square. They called me because they knew my attitude. They said, there's a real revolution going on. I said, ain't no revolution going on. Stop calling me talking about a revolution. It ain't going to be none. A few months later, they elected the president, and they start slaughtering the Muslims. You remember that? Slaughtering. They made Abdul Nasser look like a kid. They slaughtered so many. I said, well, it's open season on Muslims. Yeah, because they didn't listen. And a nigga don't have enough sense to tell them Arabs nothing. Therefore, temporary progress, oh no. Mm -mm. Temporary destabilization, no indeed. Temporary transformation, number two, organizing unity of opposition today in Syria, in Iran, in all those countries, the countries are organizing under certain principles, <coughs> including Yemen, including Syria, including Iraq. Iraq just said, we don't want y'all. Uh, Donald Trump said, we're going to stay in Iraq so we can keep our eye on Iran. You're not staying here. You know that? What's that regional, regional, that has to be regional? Who was thinking about that? Nobody. Everybody was thinking national, not national anymore. We're in a new stage. What I'm trying to tell you is, is you evolve, you smell that stuff. You, you're looking, nobody has said, even today, they ain't said nothing about that. The Arab Spring is coming, Arab Spring, what well, the Arab Spring? Talking about the air fall or swimmer, right? They haven't said nothing. You know why? Because they're stuck. They're evolving at 40 miles an hour, and the world is moving at 100. So they're evolving, but not at the speed of world transformation. And as long as you black, you going to be black. They make it down here. But you have to have the patience to, 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 to look at all of that and say, damn, man. These guys, you have to be able to do it. If you can't do it, that, that's discipline. That's endurance. That's self-control. That's sorrow. It's to be able to look at these situations and say, we do what we can. We'll be, be, be patient. Active patience. They look. Semi consolidation for regional vision. Regional vision. Iran. Iraq. Now there is Syria, Yemen, got to be Yemen, right there next to Saudi Arabia. That's regional. It's ultra beyond national. All of it. It's beyond national. I'm not saying that we got no sense, but for them, we got all the sense in the world. In the final here, we got victory, long process of regional development, personal Islam. It's the problem, al Islam. You know, uh, education and things like that, they, they, uh, they just. Tuskegee and Nas. That's the situation that we're in. So, Expose the enemy's weaknesses. And build on those opportunities. Let's just take a few more things and see what's going on. 
Top American imam says 9-11 was pretext to declare war on Islam. Was the poor guy right? Yes. Of course he was. I don't know if anybody knows that. What do you think they're going to do about it, though? You think boss man liked him? Do you think boss man likes that? And then you're not scared of boss man. That's different. And you tell boss man, boss man, if you got a gun, you can better shoot me in the head in a hurry, sucker, because another 10 minutes I may do a fly off in the, the woods somewhere. The same thing with Mukhtar then. You better use, uh, you better use a headshot. And when you do it, everybody's looking. It ain't like before. So basically, you can't do it. But that's what we're saying. Uh, let's try this here for a second. Yeah. I know we've seen shown this before. This is the rock bar. Now in Iran, we got two teams. Well, more than that. We got the team that's pro rock bar. You got the one that's anti Rahbar. They're against Velayati Faki. They're against it. They don't like it. They don't trust it. They feel it's dictatorial. The thing that Iran has that nobody else has is Velayati Faki. The Afghans don't have it. Look at Afghanistan. The Pakistanis don't have it. Look at Pakistan. Man, look at all of those countries. They don't have Velayati Faki. Now, well, what do they think about their poor brother? Revolution from Egypt to the Americas. You got to look at that now. Revolution from Egypt to the Americas. Somebody is paying attention. Because they didn't, we didn't make this, they did. Oakland and the American Islamic Revolution. If you go to Oakland, do you see a revolution? You don't see it, but guess what? How dirty and deadly it was. If you look at East Oakland now, the masjid is open only at Juma time. It's the only time you, the guy opens it. The school is closed. The property across the street from that big piece of property is sold. Well, they think it's sold. And in the last 10 years in Oakland, everything in North Oakland, under the Arabs, the Yemenis, who ain't going to do no, long as they can sell some bacon, and long as they can sell some wine in them stores, they fine. Do you think they're going to lead the Islamic charge? Absolutely not. Absolutely not. So who we got to keep this Islam from? The Negro. The chief's people neutralized. Fahim Shuaib out there. Spinning riddles. Same old stuff. I've been knowing him for 50 years almost. 40 something years. Spinning riddles. You remember the program we went up to and uh, in Jersey, it was a program. Oh, uh, yeah, the Chiefs see. people. Mm -hmm. You know how sad that was. We looked and turned around and left. They talked about Al Ghazali. This is great, and I said, "Damn, they done took our people over there and run them crazy. They done run our people crazy." Imam Jamil, this is your homeboy. He's in the pen for the rest of his life. This is your other homeboy. We killed him 2009. And, and you, nigga, part of their program is fear. Scare you to death. Scare you to death. Give you a, uh, well, what? There is nobody. You talk about Sister Bahia now. 
Sister Bahia is called on the phone the night my son, grandson was supposed to have been killed the other morning. It was at 2.05 or 2.10 or something. I wrote it all down. They ain't said nothing about it. When they took the money from my account, ain't nobody said nothing about that. Even the kids. But if you married to somebody, you might say, hey, just a minute. My kids, that's my kids' money. I don't know what's wrong. That's their college money. That's right? Not a word. And Khadija called her to get for support. Why? Because she's right in there and telling them, this is what you do to that man. And it ain't working. Just as proof, armed intruders attacked Masjid al Islam in Oakland, August 22nd. Armed intruders attacked the Masjid. That means people with guns. Three or four of them had guns. At least three or four of them Arabs had guns. They were trained with them. It was trained. Imam Abdul Ali Musa receives death threats. That's out on the trail. We done got Jamil, nigga, we're going to get you. Imam Abdul Ali Musa, uh, 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 Imam Musa arrested and held in jail 15 hours. That's when he stole $11,000. He could take this money from me, just like, I mean, I'm in the masjid and I got tax money right there, you can just take it. I thought it was 10000 but I, I forgot, you know, that you have your extra 1000 You just take it. He has carte blanche. They can do anything they want. That's wonderful. Now they got to stand on everything they did. You got to remember. Imam Musa assaulted in Oakland, California. Imam Musa assaulted that fetch behind who's behind these texts. Da, 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 da. Yes. Assaulted. Imam Musa assaulted in Oakland. Sabotage. Death threats against Imam Musa and now grand larceny of Masjid al-Islam accounts. Grand larceny. I had a guy translate some of this, but anyway, the variety of key is good. You think they like that? What's the nigga doing on, it's two years old now, on page one of anything? And he ain't talking no bubble gum. There's no bubblegum talk there. It's telling the people there, this is what you do. And you know why it's there? Because they know that I done told them what to do before, and it's always been correct. That's the only reason. Here's dear Ruhani. He's one of them. This is my homeboy, though, I tell you. You know, he put the, he gave me a call in the hospital. I couldn't, uh, the brother had to tell me, do you know who that was? It was a president. He left his meeting and came in. I said, that's wonderful. But one thing it showed up, it showed up on his website, uh, not website. Uh, it's Twitter. Twitter. Yeah. Y'all, did anybody see it? I saw, I saw the Twitter. You saw the Twitter? Really? When he first reached out, I didn't see it. You see it when he called? No, no. I didn't see it when he. No, no, no. Well, he called. I was in the hospital. Right, no, I got it. And he called. Uh, the brother went and told him what was going on. And so the president left his meeting right then. This is one they hate. They don't like him. Islamic invitation in Turkey. I told the people this is where we're headed. This is where we're headed.
his four sons was martyred, right? That's what they're trying to go with me, but they're not going to make it. I don't think they're going to make it. They're not going there. And the Iranians are not doing any better with him than me. Where are the hell are they? That's you, my question. It's so simple. You can buy this. You can, you can buy them out in Nigeria. They get Saudi money. That's what you can say. Now look here, man. And you think they'll go for it? Hell, yes. They are Nigerian. Not to be uh, better or worse than Nigerians. Bob Hoffman, Taylor Bob, and Talladega and Clarence Street, Bob is a modified that word. You know what the Negroes in Oakland say? That this guy was doing some psychological mumbo jumbo. Does anybody remember that? You know what it looks like to me? It looks like a sharp nigga with a Jewish tailor. And the Jewish tailor look at the nigga and said, boy, look at here. Because I done put the make on here and that. He said, he said, man, you make me look good. Uh, so I put it in the paper then. In the paper it goes. In the paper it goes. It doesn't look like no mumbo jumbo to me. Or something. Hanky panky, shoot, that's must have been back in 69 or something. Uh, just a few more, because see, if I don't do these, then the people think this thing right here is Pete O'Neill from the old days. This is Say Cool Dinker. You ever heard of him? Say Cool Dinker. Okay. I don't want to mention your name, brother, but I kind of have to today. Say Cool Dinker.